aperture. Peter, Peter had mentioned my interest in or openness to technology and what has been what I've been spending too much time in my life in the past four months doing is Instagram. And I post every day uh, and think about it a lot. And in fact, studiously avoid food pictures. Uh, I mean, I, I, I think I've done maybe in, in four months, maybe three food pictures that I just couldn't resist, like a really good plate of chicken fried steak in, in, in Belgrade, Montana. Yeah, you're getting me excited. Uh, here. I, I avoid animal pictures. I, I will, I've put in a couple of animal pictures. Um, yeah, about maybe three in, in four months. But I hadn't done a lot of animal pictures before. But I had done a lot of food pictures. So I don't want to, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about the Instagram cliches, and sometimes you want to, in fact, play off them. Before Instagram. I might have taken my digital camera around. Uh, but I, I tend to have like two methods of working. When I'm using, when I'm going out being a photographer, I like to do it all day long and put aside a long period of time, or even a short period of time, of, you know, a couple of weeks maybe. But when I'm working for a couple of weeks, I get up first thing in the morning and I'm out and I photograph all day long. Um, and it's like a nine-to-five job. Um, Instagram is r really more what you said, that, I, that I'll, I'll notice something, you know, and I may, I may do a series all at once and then post it over several days. So yesterday I was taking my dogs on a walk in the meadow behind my house, and, and the light was fabulous on... Uh, a clump of trees, and I did a series of pictures of it, and that'll take care of my feed for a few days. <laughs> I have to feed. I have to feed the feed exactly. <laughs>